Hey everyone, welcome to this month's new release report. My name is Clayt and I'm excited to be with you to share all of the new and exciting things we released in the month of September. September, we are flying through this year and November is right around the corner. If you haven't gotten your ticket to Icon yet, make sure you register with this link. Now we have some great things to unveil, including link shortening and text marketing, new integrations, and custom field improvements. Let's take a peek back at what was released last month. We unveiled some very exciting new features, including e-commerce capabilities and improvements to easy automations within forms and appointments. Max Classic users are loving the new text marketing features. We've got some great feedback from you. I sent texts and guess what? People called back. I now have 12 rock solid leads, but everyone has received a text with our business card to touch base. We've also heard this. I went all in on Keep Pro recently and I love it. The UI, simplicity of navigating, new way of doing forms, SMS features and mobile app are all amazing. We are so excited that these tools are helping you grow your business. If you're using any of these tools to grow, please, we wanna know about it. Tell us about it by dropping a comment in this video. Let's jump into the new things that were released in the month of September. First is a tool designed to help you get your emails opened. It's called our email subject line generator and it does exactly what the name implies. Simply select the type of message you plan to send, details on who is getting the message, and that's it. You can then select from various subject lines to use in your email to help maximize open rates. And the best part is, it's free. Follow the link in the description of this video, and trust me, you don't wanna miss out on leveraging this tool. Okay, now into our product updates for the month of September. Let's take a look at what's new in Max Classic. First up, I'm excited to announce that link shortening is now available in advanced automations. You can now send links to customers and prospects and stay under the 160 character limit. Simply click the link icon when building a text, paste in your desired link, and click insert. This will allow you to maintain tracking capabilities for important calls to action like webinar registrations, checkout form links, and more. Next up, I'm excited to announce our native integration with BigCommerce. This integration allows you to bring your products and customer purchase history into Keep to trigger automation. You can also import your BigCommerce contacts, orders, and products into Keep. Leverage the power of Keep while also having the benefits of the BigCommerce platform with this native integration. Now for our Lite, Pro, and Max customers. We have some great updates coming your way. First, we made improvements to the custom fields functionality. Overcome multi-click chaos and quickly access the data you need with a new centralized location to manage all custom fields. This can be found under the settings section of your app and gives you the ability to view, edit, and create custom fields both for the contact record as well as the company record. You also now have the ability to always show custom fields on a contact or company record by simply clicking a checkbox under the appropriate field. We've heard your feedback and have now updated the tax functionality to incorporate tax labels. This helps you ensure proper tax information is shared on quotes and invoices. When adding a tax rate to a quote or invoice, it will now display the name of the tax rate. Additionally, when you have multiple tax rates on a quote or invoice, they will now appear itemized in the payment details section. Next up is a simple improvement to easy automations. You now have the ability to easily view all whens and thens associated with a selected automation. Save clicks and gain greater visibility into your entire automation by quickly seeing everything involved with that particular automation. Okay, I am stoked about this next one. Many of you have been leveraging Keep's native pipeline functionality to stay on top of deals and grow your business. It's a great tool to help you stay organized, but the problem is you haven't had many resources at your disposal to help you track the performance of your pipelines until now. Pipeline Analytics is now available to help you make data-driven decisions based on the performance of your pipeline. Improve conversions and gain visibility into where your bottlenecks are with reports such as deal conversions by stage, average deal duration, average time in stage, deal revenue forecast, and more. 
Last month, we unveiled upsells for our Max users. Upsells allow you to maximize the revenue of every sale by offering additional products or services at checkout. Now, they're even better with recurring upsells. If you have a product or service that you'd like to bill on a consistent basis, you can now easily configure it right from within your checkout form. When adding an upsell, you can change the setting from one time to recurring, then choose the frequency, either yearly, monthly, weekly, or daily, and the number of times this charge should run. Once an order is placed, the recurring charge clock will begin automatically based on the settings you've configured, and it's as simple as that. Next up is improvements to the Keep mobile app. Now, if you haven't been using this app to stay organized and grow your business, let me tell you, you're missing out. With the most recent improvements, you now have the ability to leverage a QR code to share your contact information with prospects and customers that you meet in person. Simply select your avatar to view your business card QR code. Have your contact scan this code with the camera on their mobile device, at which point the contact can save your business information with a single tap. And of course, you can also share your contact information through a text, email, or other third-party app. Wow, what a list. Here is a quick recap of the new features and updates we showed you today. We covered things like custom field improvements, tax labels, pipeline analytics, and improvements to the mobile app. Let me know in the comments what feature you're most excited about using. And here's a list of other improvements we've made in the last 30 days. You can view more detail about each of these features in our product release notes, which are linked in the video description. Okay, now let's take a little peek at what is coming next month. We'll bring you easy automations metrics and improvements to the contact type functionality. Now, I've heard a lot about this one. Uh, these improvements will make it a lot easier to update the contact type both automatically as well as in bulk. We'll also bring our native HelloSign integration to Max Classic users, which will allow you to trigger automation when a document is signed or send a document as part of an existing automation. Join me next month for more details. Thank you for watching. Bye.